Snowboarding really changed my life. I was bullied on school and when I started snowboarding, I stood up for myself, I grow as a human. I still do, I still love it and yeah, it's uh, the greatest thing there is. I think if you are snowboarding together and you both love the same thing, you are grateful for the same things and that makes your connection stronger. I'm Chris Voss, 23 years old, I live in Holland and uh, my right leg is paralyzed. I'm Lisa Bunschoude, I'm 25 years old, I'm from the Netherlands and I'm a below the knee amputee. Snowboarding uh, means uh, a lot for me. I've begun snowboarding since I was seven. Started doing competitions since I was 12. I think uh, it's the most pure thing there is, standing sideways. I started snowboarding when I was 13. I couldn't wear ski shoes and then my brother said, just try snowboard shoes because they are softer. And I tried and that's actually how I fell in love with the sport. I think we are together for seven and a half, half years already. It's super cool to do this together and have the same passion and ride together, push each other, travel the world together and have fun and do what we love. I have a paralyzed leg on the right, so that means it doesn't work properly anymore due to a big accident when I was five years old. Yeah, I broke my hips on four places and it destroyed a lot of the nerves and a lot of uh, veins in my leg. That's where this unit comes in. This is my snowboard leg. I have a big suspension in here. It's a mountain bike suspension, but pre-tuned for my weight. Together with the ankle flexion, I have a lot of bumps that I can absorb and uh, I can make like the perfect squat. It's all made out of carbon, titanium, aluminium. It took a lot of years to develop this. I was born with what they call fibula aplasie, so in my left leg I missed my fibula and my left leg was way shorter than my right leg when I was born and I missed the ligaments in my knee. So when I was just 16 I got my foot amputated and now I'm wearing a prosthetic leg. And then for snowboarding now I use this one. I've got the brace on it because of the uh, missing ligaments in my knee. So I need this to keep my knee in place. So if I wear this leg, I can actually move my knee to the right and to the left. So I can make this movement. And that, that's pretty nice with snowboarding. I do a lot of competitions. So that's for me a big part of snowboarding, but I also love the other parts of snowboarding. Just being out with friends, having fun. I think the different aspects of snowboarding together make it really good. I really enjoy mountain biking and it connects really well to snowboarding. Chasing each other, riding, high berms, rollers, jumps, I really like it. So today we are going to Hilversum for a nice local flight. Right now I'm doing weight and balance, landing performance, takeoff performance uh, and all the things I have to do before flight uh, to make it safe. And um, yeah, we're going to see how beautiful our country is. The special thing about flying is it's like snowboarding, controlling the plane. I mean, that's a really big sense of freedom. It really feels like you're king of the world. What we ride together means for me is that snowboarding is for everyone and I think that's pretty important. It's for older people, younger people, disabled people, able body. Everybody can ride together and share the feeling of snowboarding and I think that's what it's all about. 
To be an ambassador of Burton is a huge honor. Since I was a little kid, I was following the US Open, X Games, Do Tour, watching all the big guys. And to be a part of the family and share the stoke with everyone else, especially the adaptive community, is a huge honor. We truly ride together. I think nothing is impossible. Work really hard for it, search for the right people and do what you love. Some people don't realize they can do it and if we can inspire them to go out and have fun and live their life to the fullest, I think that's the most beautiful thing you can do for each other. Yeah.